a backlog of land issues that have dragged on since the 1950s in East Newbiton province have attracted the provincial administration's attention to look into these issues. And yesterday, the issues finally got recognition. Representatives from landowner groups gathered at Vunapope Hall in Kokopo to witness the launching of this customary land online database. The inclusion of this latest technology will cater to up-to-date storage of land registration, land boundaries and even the information relating to the inheritance of the land. There are petitions coming from individuals from within the clan and are causing a lot of challenges to my administration, especially lands in terms of development. So this, the team, the team of this launching is engineering land management information system for future efficiency. The unsolved land issues in East New Britain has been leveled against poor collective political will by successive governments over the years, both at the provincial and national level. Since 1975, when the land disputes of the market came into force, it been got plenty of mediators. It's not a problem, only been suddenly strong. But because of the poor financial support from the government, past governments are going to have now. Something in the United States. While the new initiative seeks to accommodate these 50 years old land issues, it is also looking into the future. While East New Britain is going through a rapid change in development, it will need more land. Allowing developments to happen would mean negotiating with the landowners whom in recent years have become so skeptical about how their land will be used. In recent years, customary landowners have come to a point of realization about the importance of land and its scarcity as a development commodity in most parts of Papua New Guinea, while past experiences involving land disputes have become lessons for the Rabaul, the Bindings and the Pomeo people. They want to make sure that those experiences won't happen again. Edwin Fidelis, National MTV News, Kokopo.